This is my Paul Rose and Tomato. My wife is slicing one of them right now. And this is the white on the inside. A beautiful color. And we're going to see what they taste like shortly. What do they taste like? Mm. They're good, huh? Pull the oven over there. Let me take a look at it. I'm going to put on the video right quick. Man. Take and that is one of them right there. Kind of shaped funny. But it's one of the darker colored tomatoes. And I told earlier, Rob, Paul Robeson was a uh, a great African American. That one's different. Born in the early part of the 20th century. He was a lawyer, an opera singer, professional football player. He got disenchanted with the United States during the uh, 1950s between racism and McCarthyism. And he immigrated to Russia and he stayed there for a little while. And the Russian people loved him. They loved him so much that even though, even after he returned to the United States, um, and after he had died in the 80s, a Russian engineered a new tomato and she named it after him. And this is the Paul Rosen tomato. And these are the first ones that we uh, have let ripen. And the first ones we've harvested. The first one we've harvested and let them ripen inside the house because we didn't want to fight the squirrels for them. And although our hawks this year have done a good job of keeping the squirrels humble, they are still out there. And let me take a taste of one. It's nice, rich tomato. You think it's on the sweet side? Not really. It's not as sweet as some. Mm -hmm. It's sweet, but it's not as sweet as some. And the other thing is, to me, it's a little. The skin is a little thick. The skin is a little thick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's a homegrown tomato, so it'll be a good eat. Yeah, I, th I think it'll be good on the uh, on a tomato sandwich, and I plan on taking mine and making a. Uh, well, not this one because my wife's going to eat these two. But as soon as some more come off, I'm going to take them and I'm going to make myself a sandwich. I like to make a sandwich with tomato, cheese, and bacon. And she's putting season all on hers. And a little bit of pepper. And a few minutes. These two Paul Robinson tomatoes will be history. No, in a few seconds. In a few seconds. Mm. Anyway. Oh, but the seasoning enhances it. Mm. Oh, the seasoning enhances it? Mm hmm. Mm. Oh, man. Mm hmm. It does. Mm hmm. Now I'll leave juice up like this. So, mm. this is a Paul Robeson tomato. First taste test. We enjoy it. And I will be growing some more of these again next year. Mm -hmm. And luckily I have at least another five or six more tomatoes out there on the vine. And uh, at least one is ready to be brought in right now. So I'm going to bring it in. In a couple of days they'll be ready to eat, be eaten. And the others will be ready shortly. So got to get out in the garden and work. Just wanted you all to uh, see these tomatoes. Have a nice day.